how to start and complete your whole syllabus till 30 february i promise you can complete your whole syllabus till 30 february before we get into the video it is not decided yet that exam will be taken or not so keeping easy subject aside like english and hindi you can complete the whole syllabus a day before exam and in today's video we are going to talk about only science maths and sst how to complete their subjects till 30 february so let's get into the video <laughs> So we have 35 days and these days are enough to complete our Maths, Science and SST. So starting with Maths, we have 7 chapters in Maths and giving each chapter 5 days can complete our syllabus in 35 days easily. And uh, means like uh, if you are doing chapter 10 circles, you all know 10 chapter circles and maybe some of you guys completed that but i'm talking about those who haven't started yet like my one of the subscriber or viewer commented in my video that uh, he or she haven't started her syllabus yet so this is video this video is specially for her or him so let's see like if you're doing chapter 10 maybe it can take four days or three days because this is this chapter is not a very big and if you're doing 13 chapter this can take six days or seven days so you have to collect your days from other chapters like if you are doing chapter 14 you all know statistics this chapter can take only two days or three days so you can take two or three days from here and put the, these date in here so you have to adjust it by yourself but this is totally dependent on you how you adjust your days but one advice for you all is take these three subjects regularly don't miss one take every subjects in your to-do list take little task but take all these three subjects let's move on to our science how to complete your science labors seven chapters as well we have seven chapters in science too and we have uh, 35 days to complete easy we can complete it by giving each chapter seven days and now here you can do this too like uh, you can give uh, one chapter seven days and other chapter two days by this you can just uh, same as maths you can adjust your times and you can adjust your dates and you can adjust your chapters timing like uh, our environment you all know that chapter is really very easy you can complete it in one day and if you're lazy you can complete it in two days so take those three days or four days from there from our environment and give it to magnetic effect or you can give carbon and its compound or you can give periodic classification or other chapters like electricity and all so this is all about our science because science is a main chapter so you all have to give a main focus on that and at last of this video i will tell you how to stay focused and study all this and how i did it and how i become night owl and you can become a night owl too or you can become a morning person too so let's talk about our science science we have done so let's just talk about our sst so sst you all think this is an easy subject and i think this is an easy subject too because uh, i don't take it as main subject but you cannot complete the whole syllabus a day before the exam so that's why i'm saying take this sst with you as a main subject for now so we have nine chapters in it and you have to give 
four days each chapter you can do the same like we did in maths and in science like sharing you can say sharing of days you can give hard subject five days six days and you can give a small chapters two or three days so this is that's it for this math science and sst chapter division now we will talk about days and how to like complete each and every subject and if you take like let's discuss it all here only like if we take seven chapters five days each it will come to as you can see here it will come as 35 days and this is really amazing you can complete your whole subject means like whole syllabus of maths in 35 days same with science and in sst it's 9 into 4 it become 36 you can give one march to this this is not a big deal you can give one march to this or you can adjust by doing more work at a time now let's talk about on the next page how many hours are sufficient and how much hours do we have to give so that we can complete in 35 days now how many hours are sufficient for studying so if we look maths 2 hours are enough for now um like when exams are closed so you can add one more hour or you can add two more hours in it but for now this is enough for now 2 hours are enough for now you can study 2 hours daily and complete your whole syllabus and if you are feeling like you have free time after completing whole task you have free time you have uh, like 2 3 hours if you study that hour if you study in that hour one achievement that you made that day so if you are free so you can add one hour or you can add 30 minutes according to me i don't really want to study sst or this is a fun subject for me like uh, it's really boring you can say fun or boring because we just have to watch lectures from youtube and write it in our notebook and understand it that's it but take uh, one and a half hour and don't take uh, so many hours in this you will don't feel like studying maths and science give sst extra hour you can complete your sub, uh, that chapter fastly or you can just go with uh, my schedule as i said in the last page so this is these hours are sufficient so you can study 2 hours maths 2 hours science and 1 and 1/2 hour sst